Hi guys, it's Miss Kelsey again. Um, we're going to continue on with our um, Signs of Spring, and I'm going to read Eric Clarell's The Tiny Seed. It is autumn. A strong wind is blowing. It blows fat flower seeds high in the air and carries them far across the land. One of the seeds is tiny, smaller than any of the others. Will it be able to keep up with the others? And where are they all going? There's a One of the seeds flies higher than the others. Up, up, up it goes. It flies too high and the sun's hot rays burn it up. But the tiny seed sails on with the others. Another seed lands on a tall, icy mountain. The ice never melts and the seed cannot grow. The rest of the seeds fly on, but the tiny seed does not go as fast as the others. Now they fly over the ocean. One seed falls into the water and drowns. The other sail on with the wind but the tiny seed does not go as high as the others. One seed drifts down onto the desert. It is hot and dry and the seed cannot grow. Now the tiny seed is flying very low, but the wind pushes it on with the others. Finally, the wind stops and the seeds fall gently down on the ground. A bird comes by and eats one seed. The tiny seed is not eaten. It is so small that the bird does not see it. Now it's winter and there's gonna be less sun during winter, right? Yep. After their long trip, the seeds settled down. They look just like they look just as if they are going to sleep in the earth. Snow falls and covers them like a soft white blanket. A hungry, mouse a hungry mouse that also lives in the ground eats a seed for his lunch. But the tiny seed lies very still and the mouse does not see it. Now it's spring. After a few months, the snow is melted just like in spring right now. It is really spring. Birds fly by, the sun shines, rain falls, the seed grows so round and full that they start to burst open a little. Now they are not seeds anymore. They are plants. First they send roots down. Into the earth, then the, their little stems and leaves begin to grow up toward the sun. There is another plant that grows much faster than the new little plants. It is a big fat weed and it takes all the sunlight and the rain away from one of the small new plants. And that little plant dies. The tiny seed hasn't begun to grow yet. It will be too late, hurry. But finally it starts to grow into a plant. The warm weather also brings the children out to play. They have been waiting for the sun in springtime. One child doesn't see the plants as he runs along. Oh, he breaks one. Now it can't grow anymore. The tiny plant that grew from the tiny seed is growing faster, but its neighbor's neighbor grows even faster. Before they, the tiny plant has three leaves, the other plant has seven, and look, a bud, and now even a flower. But what is happening? First there are footsteps, then a shadow looms over them, then a hand reaches down and breaks off the flower. A boy has picked the flower to give to a friend.
All summer long, I'm sorry, skip the page. It is summer. Now the tiny plant and the tiny seed is all alone. It grows on and on. It doesn't stop. The sun shines on it and the rain waters it. It has many leaves. It grows taller and taller. It is taller than the people. It is taller than the trees. It is taller than the houses. And now a flower grows on it. People come from far and near to look at this flower. It is the tallest flower they had ever seen. It is a giant flower. All summer long, the birds and bees and butterflies come visiting. They have never seen such a big and beautiful flower. Now it's autumn again. The days grow short, shorter, the nights grow cooler, and the wind carries yellow and red leaves past the flower. Some petals drop from the giant flower and they sail along with the bright leaves on the, over the land and down to the ground. The wind blows harder, the flower has lost almost, almost all of its petals. It sways and it bends away from the wind, but the wind grows sh stronger and shakes the flower. Once more, the wind shakes the flower, and this time the flower seeds pop, pod opens. Out come many tiny seeds that quickly sail far away on the wind. The end. <laughs>